for the expectations of the righteous shall not be cut short. Hi, beloved in the Lord. My name is a Amelie. This is Heavenly Host Vision with Lady. I'm so glad to welcome you to yet another prophetic word. May the Almighty God bless you and keep you safe, sound, and protected. For the joy that you are coming into, for the peace that you are coming into, the light that you are coming into, the grace that you are coming into, the revival that you are coming into, for the strength that you are coming into, Whatever it is of the Lord that you are coming into this moment shall not be cut short. Hallelujah. Some of you were so happy in the past about something that was going on in your life. Suddenly it was cut short. Some of you were so, like, being so determined. You, you were so determined that some things, some things in your life were going to be like, giving fulfillment for a long time, but it was cut short. The Lord is saying this moment that the season... The season of perishing is over. <laughs> now it's a season of longevity in your life. Hallelujah. Your expectations shall not be cut short. Proverbs 23, Proverbs 23 verse 18. Surely there is a future and your hope will not be cut short. Your hope, your expectations, your future shall not be short-lifted, shall not perish, shall not be stolen from you. Someone stole your joy, your peace, your light, your love. Most things in your life will be stolen. And it felt like everything was already gone, like it's like we're already empty and there was nothing to hold on to except the fact that you have faith in Christ the Lord is, has really given a decree, even just like the previous video, and saying that you're going to be living a legacy, a, a, a legacy. Even now in this message, God is saying to you that your joy shall be for everlasting. Your peace shall be for everlasting. I'm talking now, this one, now I'm not talking about physical legacy that you're about to, to that, that's about to last forever. Now I'm talking about, about the spiritual aspect of you, your spiritual legacy. That peace, that grace, that joy, that compassion, love, revival, these things in your life. The Lord said, ponder on these things. They shall last forever. You, are born, you, are, you shall have eternal life. Glory be to God. These things shall last in your life forever. Your emotional fulfillment shall not be cut short. Hallelujah. Your health shall not be cut short. Your peace shall not be cut short. Your wisdom shall not be cut short. Your power, your glory, your grace shall not be cut short. These things shall not be cut short. This endowment, your special endowments, your spiritual gifts shall not be destroyed or cut short. They have come to stay. If, if there is any time for you to ponder on your things, on this spiritual aspect of you, so that they may last for eternity, it is now. If there is any moment for you to ponder on your spiritual endowment, it is now. Because they are set to last for a very long time. They are set to serve you for a very long time. Hallelujah. Yes, for the expectation of the righteous shall be cut short. According to Proverbs, Proverbs 28 verse 18. Hallelujah. God bless you. I love you. Faith is our vehicle of our strength. See you in the next video.